Hey everybody, I'm out here at George's Creek at Pretty Boy Reservoir today, and I wasn't intended on shooting any video, I'm just hiking along, getting some exercise, but I found some more ghost pipe, or ghost plant some people call it, growing right here along the side of the trail. Uh, this is really fascinating stuff, I looked it up again the other day, I wasn't too sure about it when I saw it the last time, but it is indeed classified as a plant, but it does have a symbiotic relationship with fungus and it actually gets its nutrients or its energy rather not from chlorophyll and the sunshine uh, it is a chlorophyll less plant it does not contain any chlorophyll but it is a flower it does have uh, flower parts a pistil and stamen and all that kind of stuff uh, the leaves on it actually look more like little scales than leaves and let me see if I can turn the flower upright. I do have these that come up in my yard from time to time and I've looked at them really closely before. If you actually look at the flower itself, these aren't even fully open. I can do this without breaking the stem off. You'll see there is color in there. There's a little bit of yellow on the pistils. I guess that's the pistils, either the pistils or stamens. I always get them confused when it comes to flower anatomy. But you can see a little bit of yellow color at the very tips of them, presumably where the pollen is. And so these are a plant like any other. They've got pollen and they rely on pollinators to propagate, but they don't get their energy from photosynthesis. They actually get it through, uh, what is it called, mycelia. It's the little parts of the fungus that sort of interact down at the microscopic root level and it shares its nutrients and energy with this plant. So again, a very interesting plant. Cannot remember the proper name for it, but if you look up ghost pipe or ghost plant, you will find links for it all over the place. Very, very interesting plant. So I'm going to keep on going. I'm not going to stop anymore unless I see something particularly interesting. So I'm going to say thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed that. I'll see you real soon in the next one.